Yes, guys, welcome back to another video on the channel, the start of a new exciting series, the first installment of a new exciting series as well. And that series is going to be, you know, icons, stories in FUT. So basically, there's a graphic on screen at the moment that I made with the rules and stuff, but a slight overview is I'm going to retell an icon story in FUT. Right. So how are we going to do this? Right. Just this is the basic overview. Bear with me. I'm excited. As you can see here, Torres played for Atletico Madrid, Liverpool, Chelsea, Milan, Atletico Madrid, and then um, Tagan Tosu. Where, wherever, I don't even know if they're in the game. I don't even know who they are, by the way. But what we're going to do is we're basically going to start a new account and immediately go and buy Fernando Torres, right? We're going to source the coins and immediately go and buy Fernando Torres and basically start our journey with Torres. Torres will start off in the Atletico Madrid era, right? So... What I can do is I can get one player. I think I might change it to two. I think I might change it to two, make it a little bit harder, a bit more, a bit more relevant. But I can basically go out and buy one player from Atletico Madrid that either plays from currently or used to play with Torres in that team, um, which unfortunately isn't applicable with Atletico Madrid. So it will just have to be a current Atletico Madrid player. I then have to play 244 games. If I move my big swell head over here, I then have to play 244 games with Fernando Torres until I can move on to his Liverpool era. And then when he's in his Liverpool era, it's the same thing. I go out and buy either one or two, depending on what we set, or players from Liverpool that either played with him or play for Liverpool currently. Perfect example for this would be Steven Gerrard. I'll go out and buy a Steven Gerrard icon and I get it done that way. We'll play 142 games with him. Then we move to the Chelsea era and we just keep rinsing and repeating. The only tradable... Um, sorry, the only non-first owner cards in the squad should be Fernando Torres himself, because obviously we have to source him, and the players from his era. Uh, so, you know, let's say we choose Marcos Lorente. We go out and buy him. He's allowed to be non-first owner. But the rest of the team have to be first owner. We're not limited to what SBCs we can do. We can go out there and, you know, we can grind towards Eusebio if we really wanted to. Like, do you get I me? Mean? There's a there's an Ibrahim Diaz out, actually, that looks like an absolutely ideal first target to try and get for this team. So... That is what this is going to be. We're starting with Torres for the first one. We're hoping to like do other icons with this as well, like a DDA drug burn, like little things like that. But obviously, we're going to need to play a lot of games. And this, this is hopefully going to be a really fun series. I want you guys to be involved as much as possible. If you want me to make a decision for a certain team, let me know. If you want me to get a certain player in the club, let me know. If you think it should be two players from the, from the era team, so two Atletico Madrid, two Liverpool, two Chelsea, two Milan, etc., etc., let me know. Or if you're happy with one, then, then calm. Just let me know in the comment section, right? That's that's literally what we're here for. So let me just stick myself back to where I was because um, that's going to be really annoying having my face cam there. We're going to get into it. We're going to start the club and everything like that now. So if I just get rid of this little Torres picture, we should in fact be there ready to make the new club. And we're going to go, we always go France. Spain could be a good shout actually um, for chemistry reasons. Uh, and you know what? There's a lot of females in the game that are Spanish as well. So we'll go... We'll go Spain. I think Spain will be a good shout. We're probably going to have to listen to that knobhead talking, telling me how to change players and change positions and all this jazz, the, the tutorial. Yeah, this little gimp here now. That's annoying. Um, right, what have we got to do? Let's sign a uh, slightly higher rated loan player. Let's go with... We want someone Spanish, I guess. So let's check what right mid is. Um, see what options we are. Oh, look at that. Marcus Lorente there, perfectly. I'm going to go with Marcus Lorente because I'm not going to lie, early doors, he seems like the, the ideal person to do for the, um, for the, what's it called? Oh, I've got to go with Cardiff City, boys. For those of you who don't know, I am literally from Cardiff, living in Cardiff. So, yeah, 100% we'll go for Cardiff City badge here. We could have went for the Real Madrid or Barca, considering we're going to be in Spanish League. Actually, how about we have to play in the Atletico Madrid kit for the first 244 games? Let's Let's do that. That's quite cool. That could be um that could be interesting. Um and we'll just go FC Bayern. I always like playing against a black kit, so that's quite cool. Uh we'll take a Liverpool badge because uh I am a Liverpool fan. And obviously Torres played for Liverpool, so we'll take that. Um we do get one of these Euro players as well. I mean oh, Van Dyke or Dembele would be banging. Uh on my RTG account I did get uh, Van Dyke, which is annoying because I have Van Dyke anyway. Uh, what's this then? Build your dream club wherever you go. Uh, log into the app before the 31st and get an untradable jumbo rare players pack. Banging, boys. 
banging. We'll take that. Hey, newcomer, start your club with some iconic loans. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, fair enough. Um, we don't need to learn an upgrade. We are a veteran in this ultimate team thing. I've been playing since 09, bruv. We start on zero coins and zero FIFA points, but we do have um, some store shit going on here. Uh, what do we get? We got a... Oh, my days. This is going to jar me out, boys. This is going to jar me. Uh, we do get a Jumbo Rare Players Pack, an Ultimate Team Welcome Pack, which I think is just loans and stuff. And also the the special Euro Ambassadors Pack, which, you know, we're hoping for Dan Bailey or Van Dijk there. Let's open up this little 100k pack, first of all. There's quite a lot of stuff in packs at the moment. Um, French CDM, Real Madrid. If that's your many, that's a great player to start the game with. Yes, boys. Come on. That's a great player to get into the team at the start. Go on, son. We take that, boys. I love normal gold, sure many. And I've got sure many Evo on my um on my normal team. We've even got Turam there as well, who's obviously a very OP player. Oh, boys. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. We have this, this, this thing with all loan stuff. Uh, one of three, 83 plus rare. Um, is this one not alone, the one of three, 80 plus? It isn't. Um, wow, my God. You've given me some stinkers there, EA. Wow, you could have given me something decent there. Um, but beggars cannot be choosers. I'm guessing the rest of these are all loans. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever, whatever, whatever. Base hero loans. Uh, we'll go for Cordoba, obviously. And the fact he's got 24 games, I mean, we could use him in weekend league. It's currently Thursday, right? So it's Thursday the 28th right now, which means we could actually... We'll go Xavi, Spanish. Torres, isn't it? Um, we could actually use these loans in the game uh, simply because I'm just going to see where it lands. Nah, nah, we'll go there. Um, yeah, we could use these loans easily. And we get a one of three ambassador loan. <laughs> okay, so we're, we're going bad, like. Well, we're going to use him, bro. Why not, innit? Why not? It's going to be hard to start off with at the end of the day. It's going to be hard to start off with. Right. If you give me a Van Dyke in this, I'll be buzzing. Um, German, can't, I don't know who this is. I don't know who the German one is. Is it Wurz? Um, yeah, that's quite shit, to be fair. Um, a bit of a bummer. I was hoping for something just slightly better, to be fair. Hoping for something just slightly better there. Um, we do get a preview pack as well, wouldn't we? So, yeah, I mean, you never know. Let's, let's preview the preview pack. You never know. We got Austrian, center half. Yeah. Pointless even watching that pack animation. Uh, so I basically need to go and source the coins for Fernando Torres before we, we get started. But early doors, early doors, right? Why are we called Bristol Villa? What is going on there? Like, I don't need the tutorial, bro. Why can you not turn this off? Why can't I just ask you at the beginning of the game? Do you know how to play ultimate team? Yes, I've played ultimate team before. Let me just fucking not listen to all this crap. Um, start from scratch. We'll just call it like El Nino. Um, I just realized something actually. I might be transfer banned on the app and stuff. So I might not even be able to buy Torres kind of straight off the bat in that sense. Um, I mean, I could probably try and transfer coins over from another account. But um, yeah, we're gonna have to see how that goes. But early, early doors, we got some decent players in the club. I feel probably gonna play a four four one one because that's what I think of when I think of Fernando Torres. Um, but look, we got Lorente that we can stick in there. We got Van Dijk we can stick in there. We got a couple of loans we can use for that like, weekend league. Like I said, it's Thursday. I oh, just noticed we got Gakpo. That's decent. Thiago Silva. Um, it is Thursday, but there is some like objectives to basically get um foot champs qualifier points like really quick. So we might be able to, to get into the weekend league quite easily, to be fair, when you actually think about it. So, yeah, we're looking good there. We need to we need to source Torres. He's currently 200k, according to um, Footbin. So if I am kind of transfer banned, the way we source the coins for Torres is going to be a little bit awkward. Uh, I might just have to rip store packs, like tradable store packs instead. Um, there is going to be a point, obviously, throughout... This series where we upgrade Torres to his winter wildcard version. And I think that should be when we get to Liverpool. Because even though it's not him for Liverpool in the picture. Um, that looks like a Chelsea version of Torres in the picture. But his, for me and for everyone else, his best version was 
at Liverpool, wasn't it? So obviously we want to kind of get him, get that version when we reach Liverpool, um, which I think will be quite cool. And we'll obviously be able to afford him by then, I'm sure, by 244 games, because everything else is going to be untradeable anyway. So all our coins are going to be available to just get in there. We've got these objectives and stuff where we can try and um, get people going. I am thinking early doors, Lorente will be the player from Atletico Madrid. And we're probably likely to pack Lorente as well, which is good. Um, also, we got our SBCs and stuff. We could run some shit through there. We'll do this daily login, actually. Oh, how do I... Do I have to complete... Oh, we'll, we'll do foundations. Like, you know, I'll skip myself doing that. But we've got the daily logins. We've got a couple upgrades. But I do think that an ideal player for us to go for, especially if we're playing 4 4 one, one will be this Brahim Diaz. He looks really, really good. It's locked at the moment, but yeah, he looks really, really good. Let me go and see if I can like access the transfer market and stuff on the web app because I want to open that 100k pack anyway. So let me go and open up that 100k pack and then um, not open it up. But let me go redeem it on the web app, come back into the, the console and, and open up that pack. So we'll just jump into that right now. All right, guys, logging on to the web app did not give me um, the 100k pack that it said it did, but I just went and did the... Um, the foundations where I had to put uh like about six in total bronze cards into the uh into the SBCs. And obviously that means we can go ahead and do the daily login. Uh we won't be able to get the group reward for this, I don't think, because we've started like a couple days in, which is a bit of a shame. But you know, the game is the game at the end of the day. Uh I think we will get some objectives for that as well. Oh, we got Jota that we could do as well. Boom. That's a great player to start um on the team oh boys we're looking good we're looking good this is looking fun it looks like it could be great it looks like it could be great uh obviously we've got all these oh we've got 100k packs as well from like rivals mastery and stuff to be fair i don't think i'm going to go into like squad battles and 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 grind them 100 on goals and stuff maybe i will maybe i won't i mean it's just it's just effort in it when you're doing stuff like that we obviously got um all these crappy things here so let's go oh where's this 80 80 by 5 come from that could be sick uh, we do have a bunch of crappy little bronze packs and stuff from the Foundations SBC, so I'll just let them go. We get my man from Atletico Madrid as well. We are, we're not going to choose him as an Atletico Madrid player to use anyway, but um, it's good that we do have him. Uh, two players pack. We get Dutch here, centre mid. Frankie De Jong. Oh, Gravenberg. Come on, Gravenberg, my boy. Any bad boy Evos that come out, he could be, he could be going through them. Uh, anyone who knows me, anyone who follows my channel knows Gavin Burke is my guy. I've put him through some bad boy juicy evos on my RTG. He's like 87 rated, high, high. Little bad boy player. Portuguese, second defensive mid. That is Ruben Neves, who is 84, I think. Yeah, boom. So we got some 84s in there. We could probably do an SBC. Like like an 83 rated SBC, we could probably do. Um, what is in the store, by the way? How have we got dupes already? I know it sounds bizarre. I'm just going to discard it. Um, yes, and do not show this message again. Fed up with all this already. Um, because we do have any of these tradable. Any of these tradable. No, right. Because I was going to say, what we do have available is the 10 coin pack and the 30 coin pack. So we can get like 30 coins real quick. I'm sure we'll have stuff in the club that we can discard that will be worth something maybe surely. Like the stadium things and stuff like that. Let's go club. And then let's do toggle list view. I mean, we might not actually have anything tradable to discard. But you'd like to think we, we would. Um, no, I don't think we do. Are the, are the stadium stuff discardable? No, I know they used to be... You used to be able to like go in and, and discard the badges and stuff. Can you do that now? No. Okay, fair enough. What about kits? Any of these quick sellable? No. Okay, we're going to have to play a game for our uh, 10 and 30 coins for the 10 and 30 coins pack. We are transfer banned, so I'm wondering if I can like somehow do it. I have to transfer them over. Or if we just, we just, we're going to have to get the 200k for Torres via the store, aren't we? So. I think I'm going to open these crappy little packs. We'll skip these. So using that coin boost pack thing, let's um let's go ahead and get these two. Uh, and we're we're gonna to have to load up some points to get Torres. Unfortunately, we can't just um can't just buy the coins, which is a bummer. 
We were getting 84 and an 83. Decent. Um, to be fair, the whole the whole point of this is that this isn't, this isn't an RTG. Obviously, we got the rules of winning first owner and whatnot. This is just to retell the, the, the Torres story. Obviously, I'm not going to be out there buying... Um, oh, my God, it's Tony Cruz. That's our first walkout. I'm not going to be out there buying, like, store packs and stuff all the time, but we obviously need to get the coins for Torres into the club, first of all. So we get Kroos, Brandt, Gabriel Pickford, decent players into the club so far, like, fair play. The club's looking all right. The club is actually looking all right. It's decent. So um, am I going to... Let me see what we got, because I know a lot of these promo packs, they're just not tradable these days, are they? Um, like, all the sick ones are untradable, which is jarring. I don't know why they do it that way. Uh, Let's go, like, see which ones are tradable, which is a replay, a special version of the Jumbo Ultimate Pack. 40 rare gold players, also one additional Jumbo gold player pack. Like, that's that's like 20 quid, in it? 3K. That's insane. 20 Jumbo rare gold players, uh, 78 of uh, 78 or higher, two guaranteed to be rated 86 or higher. This will probably be the best to try and get us money for Torres. Um, 25 rare gold players. 80 rated higher. We just need to make 200k, boys. And then, guys, unfortunately, I think the best way to get these coins onto the account is obviously FIFA points. So, we will open up a pack, the best tradable one possible, uh, because obviously we need to sell the, the contents, which is a bit of a ball ache because you look at this, right? 3,000 FIFA points for this, which is just 40 rare gold players, right? Um, you know, shit odds at specials and whatnot. We basically need a couple 86s, 87s that are going to pump us up hopefully um but then you look at the ones like these for example for the same you get three guaranteed wins of wild cards rated 86 or above it's crazy the way they force people into um untradable packs these days but we are gonna rip this one i don't even know if it's the best bang for my buck really but it gives me 40 rare players plus another 24 through the jumbo rare on the very worst case scenario i can discard all of them for 50k and just basically trade a little bit for a couple hours, you know, just do um, chem style um, trade methods and little things like that. I should be able to get to 200k, um, to be fair. So we'll we'll buy the 300,000. We'll open it up. We'll hopefully get something decent. Is that an icon? Imagine it's Torres. Um, French goalkeeper. That's my nan. But there's obviously an icon in there with it, which is fucking bizarre, by the way. Imagine this is Torres. Oh, my God. Could you imagine if this was Torres? It's Bastian Schweinsteiner. Um, do you know what the maddest thing is? Do you know what the maddest thing is? And it's an icon, right? And it probably goes for nothing. That's the craziest thing about this game. Um, yeah, we got plenty of like 87s. How the fuck are we getting dupes? It goes for 100k, guys. It goes for, what? It goes for 90k, 89k. That, I mean, that's fucking huge when you think about it. Because we got Modric and stuff as well. 87s are going for about 20k. We should be able to fund Torres off the back of this 3,000 FIFA point pack. And obviously, we also have a Jumbo Ultimate pack in there as well. I think, we, I think we'll be able to, to get Torres. Let me just check on Futbin. Um, to be honest, I don't even know why I'm still using Futbin. I think that Fut GG is way better, to be fair. 86k is what I can get for Schweinsteiner, right? And then we look at uh, cheapest player by rating for 87s, right? 87s are going for anywhere between 12 and 15k. We got a couple of them. We, we might be able to do it, lads. I think we will be able to do it. Let me stick all of this up for sale. Actually, let me stick it all in the club, first of all. Oh, I should have put it all in the transfer list. I should have put everyone from that pack in the transfer list. Now I'm going to have to go through the club and try and find the, the tradable ones and, and whatnot. Um, what was I going to do? Yeah, let me do that. And then let me open up the, the 100k pack that I got as well, because we could get something out of that. That's also tradable. Um, it's a special. It's English, left wing, Manchester City. Is there a... F oh, wait there. That's him. Okay, so who's the special? The special could be decent. Winter wildcards. Let's see what we get. Mascherano. Oh, it's a hero. <laughs> what? Hey, uh, Mascherano! I think he's only goes for about 30k as well. Um, but it means we can get closer towards Torres. I think I think we'll be able to get Torres just off the back of that, lads. We won't have to buy any coins or anything like that. That's banging. 
yeah, we we basically got Torres. We basically got Torres. We're gonna sell everything that we need to. Let me go ahead and um stick these in there. That is absolutely mental, by the way. How have we managed that? How have we managed that? But well, I'll take it. I'll take it. I didn't have to go and buy no coins. I didn't have to do nothing. That's fucking banging. Um, let me just stick all of these up for sale. Obviously, Schweinsteiner, the eighty sevens, and etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. And then we'll basically come back in an hour's time when all that's sold and just get Torres, hopefully. Hopefully, we can get Torres. Right, Mascherano was sold, but we still got these 1082s to sell. It's taken us to 208, but Torres is coming in at about 220. So <clears throat> we could either just try and snipe him for a little bit or we'll just wait for them 82s to sell. I think we'll get about 7k off of them. That'll take us up to about 215. And I'm I'm sure we'd be able to definitely get him for 215, to be fair. Um oh, I'm always rubbish at doing this. I'm sure that's 200 grand, isn't it? Yeah. So we're just gonna have to try and snipe him for now. Um and obviously once M82 sell, we'll probably have a better chance of of buying him. We can only go up to 208 for now. Yeah. Uh, but we do have them, 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 what's it called? Them objectives. So let's go and do them because we could get some bad boys out of these. Uh, live, these weekly traders. Let's do this. Uh, claim all. We need to do the buy one, really, but we need the coins to be able to do the buy one. Um, let's get her in there. Just for the higher rated. Uh, Di Mario can go in there. That's fine. These one of three eight threes could be really good for us. To be fair, we could maybe even see Oblak. He goes into the team for sure. Obviously, we need a um, Atletico Madrid presence in the team. Could be him. Um, ah, Gundogan eighty six. Take it. Like honestly, it looks like we could maybe get um, Ibrahim Diaz like almost done, which is crazy when you think about it. I don't know. I don't know what he needs. Um, but I keep calling him Ibrahim Diaz. He's not even called that. Yeah, we should definitely be able to do him. We'll need a team in a week later, though. That's the only downside. But yeah, we'll wait for the guys to sell, and then we'll we'll get El Nino across the line. Right in, as you can see, guys, we should finally be able to afford Torres now. This is going to be a long evening of grinding. Will I be able to get enough points? But champs points to be able to uh to do weekend league. Who knows? Who knows? But one thing I do know is, I don't know, if he, if he went back down to, like, what I had before, I would have been fuming. One thing I do know is I should... Oh, are you taking the piss? I should be able to have enough to get Torres. Which one has the least amount of games played? We're going to go for this guy. 234k. Welcome to the club, Fernando Torres. The star man of this series. Torres' story. We're going to recreate Torres' career. We're going to have Atletico Madrid players in the mix, Liverpool players in the mix, Chelsea, AC Milan, Atletico again. And of course, the, the Korean or Japanese team that he played for. Let's get it. Hopefully you guys are excited by this, um, this concept. Hopefully you enjoy it. Make sure you follow in on all the socials and stuff so you can get involved as much as possible. And I will be coming back to streaming. So let's get on a stream thing. Let's get happy together. Appreciate you if, you're, if you've made it this far, you're a fucking G. Um, because this is probably going to be about a 20 minute long video. I am sorry, like. But Torres is in the fucking club, baby.